what I wish I knew in class 9, atoms weren't always thought of as tiny solar systems. Once, they were imagined as plum puddings. Let's find out why. Back in 1897, J.J. Thompson discovered the electron, tiny negatively charged particles inside atoms. But if atoms have negative electrons, what keeps them together? Thompson imagined an atom like a pudding full of positive charge, with the electrons scattered inside it like raisins in a cake. This became known as the plum pudding model. So in this model, the atom isn't just a hard ball, it's more like a soft, squishy mix of positive charge with little negative bits floating inside. It explained why atoms are neutral overall. The positive and negative charges balance each other out. But, spoiler alert, this model didn't last forever. Scientists kept experimenting, and soon, a new atomic model took its place. Still, the Thomson model was a major step forward. It introduced electrons and got us thinking about the structure of atoms. And hey, next time you eat a cake, remember, you're basically holding a piece of atomic history.